I'm Ian Gutowski, and you're watching Toon News. Early this morning, Papa Smurf found dead, laying face down in his mushroom in a pool of his own blood at the ripe tender age of 542 years old. No foul play is suspected. Barney denied bail after eating four children last week in studio. When reached for comment, Barney said, What do you think's gonna happen? I'm a f***ing dinosaur. He will also be recast on next season's Biggest Loser. Moving on. Splinter from the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles is now homeless. Oh wait. Oh, sorry. Apparently he's always lived in the sewers. It breaks my heart to read this next story. Clifford, the big red dog, has just tested positive for hardware. He will be euthanized this Thursday following the Philadelphia Eagles game. Michael Vick was reached for comment and he said, it's about time they put down that big red mother <laughs> Oh, this just in, Simon of Alvin and the Chipmunks, a known tea partier, has been caught on tape screaming out, hey during a President Obama rally. Oh, I've just been reached for comment. <laughs> you, Simon. And in other news, Gruffy Gummy of the Gummy Bears has just tested positive for HGH. Suspicions grew after pulling down 117 rebounds in his first NBA game. He will be suspended indefinitely. On a lighter note, SpongeBob SquarePants is expected to make a full recovery from his current battle with throat cancer. Recent studies have shown that when fruit is submersed in salt water over an extended period of time, emits 98% pure cancer. Sometimes it's not so good to live in a pineapple under the sea. Dora the Explorer deported back to Mexico after being captured in Arizona on suspected drug charges. Apparently that backpack was filled with more than just hopes and dreams. Try three kilos of Peruvian flake. That's right, kids. Dora the Explorer is a coke mule. Speaking of donkeys, Eeyore has found a job after years of unemployment. He has joined a traveling donkey show in Argentina. Congratulations, buddy. It's a great gig. I've been on both sides of that business. Well, that's all for two news. I've been the eyebone crushing it. Let's do brunch.